Uh, so this is going to be a bit different than my other videos. This is kind of just going to be an update-ish type of video with just addressing some stuff. So if you don't like these type of videos, just wait for my next video. Uh, so around me, you will see some Vita footage, which I'll talk about the games that it's playing right now in a second. Uh, but firstly, I just want to address, if you've subscribed to me over well, the past four months when I've had this channel, thank you very much. Um, the subscriptions mean a lot to me. I'm sure everyone, if you have a YouTube channel and you make content, uh, you know how much subscribers mean too, so thank you very much. Um, so I bought a capture card which came today in the mail, and originally this video was supposed to be me capturing something off the PS3, uh, but I realized I'm stupid and I didn't buy a component cable for the PS3, so when I go to work tonight I'll go buy one. So hopefully tomorrow uh, my capture card will be up and running. Uh, with the capture card, tell me if you guys want me to do like some sort of gameplay-ish videos more often or something like that, just because I can do that now. I probably won't do a Let's Play because uh, I'm not that interested in them, but tell me what you want to see. If you want me to make a video about something, just tell me and I'll try to make it. So these Vita games which I've been playing, I bought the Vita a couple of days ago, and I think it's brilliant so far. Um, so the first game is Mutant Blobs Attack. Um, this came for free with PlayStation Plus. If you don't have a PlayStation Plus and you have a PlayStation Vita or PS3, uh, I highly recommend you get it just for saving money purposes. You get a lot of stuff, especially with a Vita. Um, you just get a lot of free games with it. I think, well, if you're in the US, you have a different games than what I get because I'm with, like, the EU um, PSN. So this month, I think everyone else in the EU is getting Mortal Kombat. But because Australia sucks really bad, um, we were refused classification because we didn't have an R18 plus rating before, so I don't know what game I'm getting next month. This first game is Mutant Blobs Attack. It is really just a fun platformer game. It has some puzzle elements. Um, it's really just a great game to give away on PlayStation Plus. It's just mindless fun, really. Uh, next game is Raymond Origins. Now, this game was my first game I played on the Vita. And my jaw basically dropped when I saw actually how beautiful this game was. Um, I know it's also beautiful on the PS3, like the art style is like this hand-drawn, um, really vibrant colors kind of thing. And some of my friends were even telling me to get it on the PS3, but there were just so many games out that I didn't um, actually play that on there. So I'm really glad I got to play it again as a platformer. Um, and all the mechanics work really well. It is Gravity Rush. Uh, I'm sure all of you have heard these types of games if you've um, seen a lot of the Vita stuff before. Gravity Rush is just a really fun um, game. It's kind of third person action-y but you can augment the gravity of the world um, which changes up stuff a bit. And the last game I'm playing on here is PlayStation All Stars Battle Royale. Um, I did a review for that on the PS3 so you can watch that um, just off my channel if you want, but uh, the Vita version works nearly exactly the same as the PS3 version, except for, well, there's no L2, R2 buttons, so like to pick up items, you got to press the touch screen. But other than that, that's fine. Um, matchmaking, I found, is pretty much the same. It's just instead of playing, if you're too lazy to go into your TV, uh, you can play in bed, play PlayStation All-Stars. And also, good and bad with that is the trophy list of it, I thought... That's alright, you can kind of, if you don't want to play the story mode on the PS3, you can just play that when you're on the go um, on the Vita. But the trophies are actually two different trophy lists. So on the plus side, you get two Platinums, but on the downside, you can't work towards one when you're on the go. Now some other stuff that has just been happening. Um, Nino Kuni demo comes out tomorrow, so maybe that'll be the first thing I capture on my capture card and talk about that, because I'm so excited for that game. Um, if you've never heard of it before, go look it up and watch my video in the next couple of days. Uh, that should be good. Uh, Spike Video Game Awards are in, I'm going to say, three or four days. I should have a predictions video just the day before or something like that, just something fun. Uh, so that should be alright. Still working my way through Assassin's Creed 3 and Borderlands 2. I won't make actual reviews for them because... Uh, they came out a couple of months ago. I'm sure you actually know if you want those games or not. So you'll just see what I think about them when I end up making a top 10 list of this year. Uh, which I will make that... I'm not sure exactly when. I've played most games I want to play. I still want to play the Hitman or Far Cry 3. Just because I haven't played them yet. And they look pretty awesome. So I'll at least play one of them before I make the list. 
Uh, yeah, I think that's the end of this video. Again, stay tuned for my next videos. Um, if you like this video, you can like it and you can subscribe somewhere over that way or on my channel or something like that. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye.